For you ready from uh, Tom and Tamworth? Let's feel the love. Come on, Dom, you muppet, you too, fan, my ass. <laughs> That's what it says. Oh. The awful Dodger do a live line. Great David all over your. Huh? Is he all over your? He's not over mine. No, all mine. Tell me what you can do. Rachel, point out who's in the lead, please, on the votes on the screen. See that? That's yeah. me. Right. With a dodgy haircut. And then I'm in the lead. Yeah. And then, then Carrie. Yeah. She doesn't like her photo either. Right. And then where's Dominic Byrne? I'd say Dave's before Dominic. But Dave hasn't even played his then record. Exactly. That's how rubbish your choice was. Ridiculous. Then it's all, actually, it's probably then you, Chris, then Dom, and then Archie Allen's creeping up as well. How can I be last with it? That's ridiculous. Dominic Allen is creeping up behind it. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Dom, really? You're going into negative votes now. This is a farce. <laughs> Do you know... The photos that are used on on the voting system for yes. this are all the ones that were from the body image campaign, the, right. the ones where we've all been touched up. Oh, these have been touched down. <laughs> These are awful pictures. I've been touched up. They've been it's touched down. Awful. Anyway, look. Dominic, according to the votes on the screen, you got no votes. Yeah. That may have been a bit too avant-garde for people. Statistically, your record sucked. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Uh, we have a couple of choices left before Joe Wiley gets in. It's uh, 9.52. Uh, the next one is Matt Fincham's. Now, I'm going to do this for you, Dom, because I love you. Sure. So oh. if you thought Dominic's choice was bad... <laughs> oh, no. Oh, we're about to play Matt Fincham's. Oh, but do you need to start it with Aled? Because Matt is filling, filling in for Aled. Yeah, yeah, added. so vote for Aled. You just send a text saying Aled. 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 This is a dance classic. Mm-hmm. Now, out of every song in the world that he oh, could have chosen... This is a darn The classic. Verve, Bittersweet Symphony. Yeah, classic. Robbie Williams, mm. Angels. Mm. Jerry and the Pacemakers, <laughs> yeah. Never Walk Alone. Yeah. The Rolling Stones, Honky Tonk Woman. Mm. He didn't choose any of those. Dupe by Dupe. He didn't even choose that. I was going to do that, actually. But you didn't. No. You did this. Matt Fincham shows night crawlers. Hey, double one, double nine. Just send your abusive text starting with the word Allard. Because <laughs> we're using Allard for Matt's vote, okay? He'll hate that, won't he? Yeah, he will. Says Meg from Cheltenham. Matt, I love this song. Says Katie and Tembi. Emma loves it. Old school classic. Debbie and baby Annabelle Royston. And Wayne is texting as well. Wayne. Oh yeah, Wayne. Yeah. Uh, Kerr. He's texting. Yeah. John Kerr's brother. Yes. Has texting. I don't know whether he likes it or not, though, Matt. I've got to be honest with you. Mm. Chew is texting as well. Mm -hmm. His surname is Pididiot. <laughs> Pididiot. He's French. Yeah. Pididiot. Yeah. Italian. Pididio. <laughs> this track is massive. Yeah, he says Ryan. Tune, Matt. Chris says it's good. Steven says it's good. So, you know what? You can have it there, mate. You can have it. Mm. Thank you to everyone. Alan's still last on the votes. Oh, yeah. Okay, the last song this morning belongs to Mr. Comedy Dave. If you'd like to vote for Dave as the best song, here's what you do. If you go to the live streaming, the webcam version, you'll see on the screen you can vote, okay? You just click on the person you want to vote for. The next song belongs to Dave with his squashed face and happy smile. Or if you're not watching, get your mobile out, text 81199. <laughs> squashed face and happy smile. It's a bit yeah. squeezy smile. 81199 is the text number. Start your message with the word Dave. Dave, if you want to show your appreciation for Dave choosing this track. 
It seemed only right under the circumstances. You've had stiff competition this morning as well, haven't you? Mm. As loud as you can and start texting now. Dave has chosen Oasis! Is claiming that she won the vote. No, I'm not. I'm just pointing at it. And just because I thought you would get more votes than that, Dave. I'm not bothered, Rachel. I would have. That's the one I would have voted for. I think there's a bottleneck. Is that right? For everyone that saw them last night or is going to see them tonight and tomorrow at Wembley Stadium. Wembley. Wembley. It's a great big place in London and the call it Wembley. Wembley. There you go. So thank you very much for all the text messages that came in. Uh, that was your golden hour. I'm off till Tuesday. Vernon Kay is here then. And now Joe Wiley. Are you all broken this morning? No, not at all. You're not? You're no. Okay. You look like a bit Liam Gallagher-esque. No, I look, Chris. I, look, I look well cool. <laughs> you do. Shades in the studio. More like Paul Gallagher. Hey, listen. <laughs> he I, um, is a lovely individual. <laughs> can I just say, I, uh, who's a lovely individual? Paul. Paul is a mess. <laughs> I haven't seen him for quite a long time. He's, He's a, lo- a lovable mess. <laughs> You know, you know, you know. Every time I see him, he he has the nerve to go, "Hey, up there, fatty." I'm like that. Get over. <laughs> you are twice the man I am, Paul. Literally, He's a very, very cheeky man. Very cheeky man. Anyway, <laughs> yeah. Um, so I'm listening to your audio book yesterday, and the idea <laughs> Don't was Don't do that. No, listen. I'm trying to find words that you say so we yeah. can edit them about and have you say things Play. you never said. Yeah. yeah. Then I heard what you said about me because I didn't realise you talked about me in it. You should have read the book. And um, can I just say thank you very much? Oh. Good. And I've, I've got it here to play. Um, <laughs> have you? Yeah. Hang on, are you... Oh, are you no, no, no. What have you done? No, no, this is amazing. This is what Joe says in a book. <laughs> okay, all right. All right? Yeah. Yeah. Here's what she says. Wow. Andy Parfitt turned things around for Radio 1 when they hired Chris to do The Breakfast Show. Chris was something entirely different, of course. He's a DJ who cares about the music mm-hmm. rather than celebrity. Mm-hmm. I'd imagine he's so grounded because he wasn't hugely famous until quite late on. Mm-hmm. And he's also a smart guy. He's one of the great <laughs> sex symbols of our time, but he's not obviously flirtatious. Wow. He's just a great human being. Yeah. Not only is he quite nice eye candy, but he's yeah. also very funny and charming and a great raconteur. That's very well. <laughs> That'll be you. Jake Gyllenhaal or something. No, no, that's me. That's, that's, that's incredible. Well, we've got compliment. a special relationship, you know. I like... I like I Eye candy and was it? Not only is he quite nice eye candy, yeah. but he's also very funny and charming and a great <laughs> raconteur. I'm a great raconteur. <laughs> mm, what kind words. Mm. Well, you know how much I love you. Wow, I can't, I can't wait to read. You not realise quite book. that much. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I mean, it's just you're just so. Well, you're just you know, so nice about me. He's just a great pay, human being. Oh, thank you, you paid me a lot of money, so you know, fair's fair. Joe, All uh, true, every we, single word of it, we, of can, we can ask Joe questions about everybody, so it's really good. Yeah. <laughs> so Go we, we can say, okay, uh, Joe, what do you think of... Um, um, ben Nahal. Cooper? What about Nahal? Nahal? He's a DJ okay. who cares about the music mm. rather than celebrity. Right, okay. And uh, what do you think of uh, Dr. Fox? He's just a great human being. <laughs> <laughs> he is, isn't he? Oh. Yeah. He is. He bless him. <laughs> uh, what, what do you What do you think about Mark Thompson, the director general of the BBC? He's also a smart guy. Yeah. He's one of the great sex symbols of our time. <laughs> wow. But he's not obviously flirtatious. He's not. No, well, he, well. Actually, no. <laughs> <laughs> the UK's official number one. one. Listen Sundays from four to Radio One's chart show. He's just a great human being. Oh. Turn up the music. Let's get out on the floor.